high okay let's deal with this in two ways okay the first method we have square root of square root of x square root of 2 equals 2 do not bother just square this and square this this and this will go now the first square root has gone right we now have um, square root of x square root of 2 equals 2 squared okay if you like you can just work on this or leave it like this now I will have to square again and then the whole of this will be squared this is going with this one and now we have x root 2 to be equal to 2 then the powers will multiply will now get 4 now what do I do again I still have to square and the whole of this will be squared because of the square root here now x squared will come down then this can go with this then we multiply this by 2 and then we have 2 to the power of 8 now what do I do from here okay to proceed from here we can just divide this by 2 and divide the whole of this by 2 2 will go there okay and if that happens we have x squared to be equal to 2 to the power of 8 over 2 and this 2 here is the same as 2 to the power of 1 right so that our x will now be 2 to the power of 8 minus 1 since we are dividing pick one of the bases and subtract the powers so now our x sorry this is square here our x to the power of 2 will now be 2 to the power of 7 okay but mind you we are looking for the value of x not the value of x squared so i will square both sides and this will be equal to plus or minus the square root of 2 to the power of 7 right and then what can i do this will go with this then we have x to be equal to plus or minus 2 to the power of 7 to the power of 1 over 2 okay remember 2 to the power of 7 raised to the power of 1 over 2 is the same as the square root of 2 to the power of 7 now our x from here is equal to 2 plus or minus 2 to the power of 7 over 2 because we can just open the bracket so the first method gave us this let's try the second method okay so I want to apply the second method now this is square root of square root of x square root of 2 now this x is under 2 square root sign so we can write it as x to the power of 1 over 2 times 1 over 2 right then multiply by these two here is under 3 square root sign so we have 2 to the power of 1 over 2 times 1 over 2 times 1 over 2 and the whole of this is equal to 2 now multiply what we have here so we have x to the power of 1 over 4 right then multiply by 2 to the power of 1 over 8 and then the whole of this is equal to 2 right now why don't we divide both sides by this so that x will be free first okay so now we have x to the power of 1 over 4 okay being equal to 2 divided by 2 to the power of 1 over 8 dividing this one by this right so that if we go ahead now this is 4 do not forget so we have x to the power of 1 over 4 now to be equal to this is to the power of 1 2 pick one of the bases and we have 1 minus 1 over 8 as the power now we have x again to the power of 1 over 4 to be equal to 
2, then 1 minus 7, let me do that here, 1 minus 1 over 8 rather, you can just multiply this by this and get um, 8, then minus 1 here, everything is over 8, and then we have 7 over 8, okay, so that is 7 over 8 for the power, here now we have 2 to the power of 7 over 8. So what again do we have to do? I have to do away with this. I have to do away with this. And if I do that, I'll have to write it again. x to the power of 1 over 4. Then this will be multiplied by 4. So that we'll be able to cancel the 4 from here. Then on the other side, we'll have 2 again to the power of 7 over 8. Then this 4 here will also reflect here. This will go with this now. And then we have x to be equal to, now, 4 here, 1, 4 here, 2. So we now have 2 to the power of 7 over 2, right? So this right here becomes the value of x. But then, using the first method, what did we get as the value of x? Okay, so the first method gave us that x is equal to plus or minus 2 to the power of 7 over 2. So this is what the first method gave us. And the second method gave us one um, solution. The first gave us two solutions. So which of the methods would you use? The first, which gave us this, or the second, which gave us that?